And knowing so much about pro wrestling is what got me to write the story in the anthology called It's in the Faith. It's not fake, it's written from a first person perspective. It's written from a perspective of a pro wrestler who has just come back from the ring, uh, having had a match with his opponent, and is thinking about the art wrestling and is educating. So it's not fake, it's aimed at both wrestling fans and non wrestling fans. Wrestling fans, because the wrestler himself is talking about experiences that even pro wrestling fans who like to peek behind the curtain, as they say, will be endeared to the term that he's using. Where casual fans, the fans that don't like wrestling, will have a newfound respect for pro wrestling, having known what these guys go through on a daily basis. They're human just like you and me. It's just that they're trained and they are now performing in front of crowds and what they do is not considered violence, it's considered an art form. It's actually a very high state of theater, you could say. So it's, it, it, it is an art form and it is told from the point of a wrestler who's like, these people call it fake, but they don't know the pain and the real hazards I go through. And my day-to-day -day life, how I actually have to go to the gym to keep the shape of my body, to look and it's this physique. So it's all from that perspective. It's all from the perspective of a pro wrestler. So it's for both wrestling fans and non-wrestling fans. So that is basically what the short story is about in the multi-part anthology 2024.